Hi, this is a visual basic tutorial and this very tutorial I'm going to develop something that looks more or less like a health form. So I'm going to click on uh, my tab right there. That's my tab. Just move the tab somewhere here. It's all about creating or developing help file for a system, whatever system you develop. You should be able to implement a help file into it. So maybe just reduce the size of this and uh, if you like, you don't have to, but you can always enter a label up here and just uh, give it a name. Let's say help. Uh, I can just call it the information system. We have our own information system there, so the next thing I will advise you to do is make sure you increase the font so that uh, your audience can see what's happening right there. So just increase the font to about that, so that's fine. So I will need another label actually. I might as well copy this label, just paste it inside the tab. Okay, and this very label. I will now get some information about what my program is all about. So let me go to Word and just make up some. I'm just going to enter run, run function right there. Let's make that maybe 8 by 8. I'm not going to use all of those. Yeah, it's sort of like generate some information for me. I think uh, this would do. Let me just copy it. Or maybe start from the top right there. Copy all of this and just dump it there. So that's what we go right in front of my tab button there. So I just need to go to the text property and change that there. So the next thing I will do is let me come to auto. Let's select the list box first. Come to auto size and change that to force there. And you can always enlarge it so once your system opens up the first thing you will see is the information about what your system is about right there so now let's go to the tab you see the tab right there so I'm just gonna come down here where it says a uh, tab page click on the tab page and uh, just change the name of this very tab to system information or system info look for the text that's it right there just say system info right there and the next one we can always change that to maybe help okay that's fine now up here you see system info and help in the help session I will now add a split container which is uh, right there okay there so that's just to divide the, the screen uh, the tab into two then the next thing I will do is let me add a rich text box here increase the size of my rich text box go to the font right here that's the font change that to maybe about 16 yeah that's cool now this the other side of it we need uh, a tree view that's it right here add a tree view there that's my tree view right there okay now select the property of my of your tree view okay once that is selected now look for where it says node click on that and add the very first thing I do in there is go to the text and within the text there I can just say system system um, system information I know I have a lot of system information but that's the first one which we appear there now the second node is maybe about uh, label entire information about label okay what you should notice is the name of this uh, node right there the second one is node one look at the first one it's called node zero so I'm going to add another one that's node, uh, node two right there so let me just call that a 
you travel now add another node this node I may call this node um, maybe order all the details okay I'm just I think that should be enough for this information uh, system now you have all of it there this will be node 0 node 1 2 and 3 so if I double click on my system right now all I just need to then use an if statement if e dot node right there dot name there equals entire speech map node zero then wish I wish text dot text equals in speech map as well as follows I'm just gonna copy anything here copy that copy and go back to my program and just paste it let me close this paste it there okay that would be the first information now the second part of it, maybe just copy this. Now, come in here, paste that there. That will be for node one. That's node one. Just delete all of that. Okay, all the content deleted. I might as well just copy and get the other ones ready. That is for node two. I think I do, I do have up to node 3. Let's pick this another one that's node 3. So I'm just going to copy again from what I made up earlier on. Copy that. Copy. Go back to my program and paste it there inside node 1. Now let's go back. Now copy again. Let's copy this go back into my program paste that into node 3 there now uh, that's into node 2 now I need one for node 3 just move this here okay maybe copy this very one and paste that inside node 3 okay node 3 there so that is supposed to be some explanation for what my program is all about now that I've completed uh, I've completed the coding so all I just need to do now is to try the program out and see how it will look like now just try it out and see run the program and there this is how the program look like right in there the first page of the tab is all about my information system so if I click on the help file click on system information that's what you get click on label that's the information you get about label click on travel information about travel is displayed click on object and that's the information about object so guys this is how you develop uh, information box for maybe a uh, your help file after you finish developing your program so i hope this is helpful i'm just gonna call it today and bye for now